What's grabbing guys? It's Captain Facial here, and today I'm here to talk to you about a lesser known chic technique, the Sammy Nair. Shoutouts to Drugged Fox, aka Sammy. Yeah, I can call him that. For writing about this technique in his blog, Portrait in Smash. Definitely check that out after you're done watching this video. But anyway, the Sammy Nair is when a Sheik does a shuffle Nair, but fast falls before she inputs the attack. Sounds simple enough, right? Well, the idea is, but it's actually a very powerful tool for Sheik in many cases. First off, just to get some technical stuff out of the way, Sheik's short hop takes around 37 frames before you land normally. But if you fast fall, it only takes around 26 frames for her to land. This means that if you short hop and fast fall, your jump is much less reactable and you're vulnerable for a shorter period of time. So the reason why this Nair in particular is so good is because it allows you to set up a consistent way to get the lowest possible Nair on shield, while still fast falling to make yourself less vulnerable. This is actually Sheik's safest shield pressure. It's plus zero on shield, meaning Sheik is actionable the same frame that the defender is. Whereas auto cancel fair is actually only minus one, meaning the defender is actionable one frame before Sheik is. Also, because the Nair comes out low to the ground, it's a mix up between the Sheik doing a Sammy Nair and the Sheik doing empty hop grab. They look identical until right before Sheik lands, and that makes it a really strong tool against shielding opponents, because they don't know which one you're going to do until it's too late. Another reason why this Nair is so good is because it leads into combos easily. Nair's trajectory makes it send the opponent more vertically than Fair does, so it pops the opponent up for juicy combos. This technique is pretty difficult though, despite seeming simple. My suggestion is to keep grinding it, because it really just takes practice to ingrain it in your muscle memory. In order to test to see if you're doing it properly or not, boot up the 20XX hack pack and set the CPU to shield grab after you hit their shield. If you time the Sammy Nair properly, you are actually able to jump over the opponent's grab before it hits you, even against tall characters like Marth. Well, that's about it for this video, but before you go, feel free to leave a message in the comments about what video topic you'd like me to cover next. It can be about Sheik, or it can relate to any character. Make sure to subscribe to SSBM Tutorials on YouTube, to thumbs up this video, and to follow me on Twitter at SSBM underscore face roll. I hope this video grabbed your attention, and have a nice day.